At first, I was hesitating to stop, but something in my mind told me to just pull over and help. Many people are grateful 18-year-old Robert Golden stopped at this crash scene in Port St. Lucie Thursday. A motorcyclist and the driver of a PT Cruiser collided at the intersection. Um, the motorcyclist was ejected from the motorcycle and sustained some really severe injuries to his leg. Port St. Lucie High School senior put his training he received, he says, from his father, an Army vet, to work. I, I don't know what took over. I think it was just the adrenaline, and I, I just took charge. I saw nobody else was doing it, and... I had to do something about it. He borrowed a belt from a bystander, wrapped it around the victim's leg, and pulled to stop the blood flow. His first question was to call his wife, asked to call his wife, and then he asked if he was going to live. And I said, yeah, you're going to live. Five minutes later, paramedics arrived. His principal still caught off guard. Do you apply the tourniquet to his leg? And he said, yeah, I did. And I was kind of dumbfounded. And then he showed me the picture that someone had taken of him, and I looked at it and I couldn't believe what I was seeing. Police say a 66-year-old Port St. Lucie man was driving the motorcycle. A 17-year-old girl was driving the PT Cruiser. Golden says he doesn't think he's a hero. Police disagree. He put a tourniquet on this man's leg, essentially saving his life. Uh, could have been fatal. So this, this boy's a hero. And police here in Port St. Lucie say they are still investigating this case. In the meantime, they say the victim is still recovering. In Port St. Lucie, Angela Rosier, WPBF 25 News.